App Tethering is one of the key new features. It allows you to easily extend your existing Windows applications onto mobile devices. It works by creating companion apps between both VCL and FireMonkey applications that connect via Wi-Fi and your local area network. It supports the automatic discovery of companion applications. And then those applications can publish actions and invoke actions with their companions. They can also share standard data types and data streams. This is the photo wall tethering demo. How it works is there is a mobile app that allows for the capturing of photos and then can share them to any of the photo wall companion apps. So we have two photo wall apps. One is written in the VCL and one is written in FireMonkey. All three apps have a tethering manager and a tethering app profile. The way it works is you have one tethering manager and then one or more tethering app profiles. So for the photo app, the profile has an event that occurs on resource received. We receive the image as a stream and load it up for display to the user. I'm going to go ahead and run the mobile app on my Android and then the VCL app here on Windows and the FireMonkey app on Mac OS X. Here is the app running on my Note 3. Here is the VCL photo frame. And then here is the FireMonkey photo frame running on OS X. So I'm actually running inside a virtual machine here. And so this is running on the host OS. And so it's actually in front of the virtual machine window. Now you'll notice the mobile app has automatically discovered both the VCL and the FireMonkey receiver app. Once the new app's launched, I can use the refresh button to go out and discover those again automatically. All the only requirement is that they're on the same subnet of the local area network. So I'm gonna go ahead and take a photo here of my keyboard. And it automatically sent the photo to the selected VCL receiver, and I can tap the FireMonkey receiver and send it to there. This is just one example of what you can do with tethering. The other common use case is to use it to invoke actions on other apps. So for example, there's another demo that shows starting and pausing and controlling a media player from your mobile device. App tethering is a great way to extend the reach of your existing desktop applications onto mobile devices.